Hey guys, I hope you can hear me. Uh, the wind's kind of blowing out here a little bit today. But I was gonna say I kind of went, went to uh, Washington, dropped off a trailer the other day, Ellen Fur, Washington. Made it back to there and got a hotel room, and uh, woke up next morning, come outside, got going down the road, and luckily I had a partner. I had a, another guy running with me, and he noticed my license plate was missing on the back of my truck. Somebody had stolen my license plate. So, I had to come all the way back across the country with no plate. And today what I'm going to do, I'm going to make an attempt. The wind is cutting up. I'm going to make an attempt to uh, secure my new license plate where I can't, you know, to deter anybody from getting it off. They can get it off, but I'm hoping to deter them from getting it off. And I was going to show you how I was going to do that. I bought these carriage bolts. I have drilled out the holes a little bit bigger in my plate. And what I plan on doing is dropping these through. Now there's no head on the outside. I have to drop the spare tire and go in behind the bumper and take off the uh, self-locking nuts. If somebody wants it that bad, I guess I'll just get it. So I'm going to put this together and see how it turns out. There are square holes in here that you can see the little plastic pieces used to lock into. And that square hole is the same as the square on the back, on the bottom of this carriage boat. So that's what I'm going to try to do right quick. And with the wind, I'm probably going to try to get it finished up and then I'll show you what I've got going, how it turns out. So that's it. I um, put the carriage bolts in. First thing I did was took this and opened up the holes big enough for the square head to go through the tag. It still had to be tapped through a little bit, but not much. But it locked into the holes on the bumper, the square holes where the plastic tabs used to lock in. And I put a washer on the other side and I put the lock nut. And then I took the uh, took a battery powered ratchet and I had to hold out here firm and reach around behind it and zip it in and once a spare tire goes back up I don't think there's any way anybody would take that tag off it's possible but it almost have to be cut off I think they weren't getting enough and if somebody wants it that bad um <laughs> they can pretty much I guess they're gonna get it but anyway that was my idea on how to keep someone from stealing your tag I hope it helps somebody out hope it helps me out and I uh I'll see you guys next time